So if you've got a specialized ERP system that, that has issues uh, that you need for your manufacturing business, well, you don't want to make sure that either A, the service provider that you're selecting has experience working with that or can work with the support for the ERP system to you know get whatever they need completed. So that's going to be upgrades, maintenance, repairing of the software, troubleshooting issues, of course. But it's going to be any of those types of those types of things that you're going to really look out for. And then, um, you know, how long they've been in business? I think that's a big thing. Uh, you know, did they just start up yesterday? Did, did the guy just quit his job or, or get fired and he just started an MSP? Uh, you know, that may not be very reliable. And, and of course, in the beginning, it's very tough starting a business, of course. Um, but if, if that person's, again, not available because they're looking for full-time work or whatever, then that could also be a problem. We also see um, sometimes people are using you know, their brother that's into computers and he can kind of do it part time. Um, well, and, and that might work in the beginning. It certainly doesn't work for businesses that are relying on their technology day in and day out. And if there's a major emergency and you're calling, you know, your brother's uncle that does computers or whatever, uh, he's at, at his full time job and he can't get to you until, you know, later this evening. So really making sure that their availability, reliability, um, the response and, and their expertise is all exactly what you need and what you're looking for.